All right, so I'm just at the river, just behind my house there, where I do all my testing normally, because it's a quite a good spot for it. I've got the GPZ on. That's the settings there. You'll never see it. The screen's pretty pitiful. High yield normal 20 anyway, and the volume there is on 12. Audio smoothing low, which is what I like. Semi-auto, ground smoothing off. I'll just jump out of all that. And there's a tiny little nugget there, the 0 0.03. I'll put rocks either side of it so I can't get either coil closer and I'll scrub coils across it. And So you can hear there, it's quite a distinctive, easy target. Just shut that down and put it away. So that was using no boosters or anything to make it sound better. Fire this sucker up. And hear that I'm scrubbing it over the rocks. I don't know if anyone would hear that target. Go to auto. That's the threshold I want. That's what I get. Still, I wouldn't find that. Bang it up. I don't know if you're meant to noise cancel all the time after changing it, but it doesn't hurt. Sometimes it makes it worse, but we'll see. all over the coil let's drop it down so I find the threshold worse in the manual than an auto this is behaving quite good compared to yesterday though but I'm in a different location obviously not near the big power lines like that place has got through it I don't know what point the threshold would be considered stable. That's not too bad there. As I start to introduce EMI, it just makes the target even harder to hear. Not that I would have got it at this point anyway. Oh, can't tell if that's the target or EMI there.
See how it can make it worse, not better? I don't think it does a noise cancel, I just think it changes. And you just keep trying till you get it right. It's not actually searching for a clean channel. That's why it's so quick. I think I do vaguely hear it on Auto Plus. wait for the Commodore 64 to boot up. The old tape drives take a while to kick in. Don't need to mess around with this one. Easy target, I think. Now the response closer to the coil is much better. See, I'd get it as if it was basically a surface target. It is a really small nugget though, 0 0.03. And it's not got, it's not a meaty one or anything, it's quite... There's nothing much to it. It's not thick. It's quite thin to get back down into the gravels again the same spot even lifting up night and day if you ask me so i don't know if that's part of the fault or if it's how it is meant to be it is a bigger coil i guess 11 inch versus 8 inch but i don't know don't know what normal is i'll just have to send it away i think there's nothing i can do except do that and just see if a replacement comes back better than it because it's not good